good evening and welcome to my channel you just in time I'm having a monster's ball Tonight's feast, we're gonna begin with Al Capone's favorite spaghetti with walnut sauce and Parmesan cheese. Let's try it. pretty good. I'm sure Al Capone ate the best of the best of meals. He was truly a treacherous person. The most dangerous, most ruthless, most powerful person back in that day. Al Capone. And the scarier thing that Al Capone, um, about Al Capone is that he was real, a real human. So a real life monster is even scarier than a made for these monsters. So that was Al Capone's favorite spaghetti with walnut sauce, Parmesan cheese. Next, can you guess? We have green mashed potatoes. And dessert, a cookie with a rainbow. Can you take a guess? and whose favorite meal this is. Next up, the leprechaun. His favorite meal, green mashed potatoes. And I decided to give him a dessert in celebration of St. Patrick's Day. coffee. Comment down below and let me know which monster loves Sour Patch Kids and Fonfetti Cake. And I will let you know at the end of the video. So next up, if anybody can remember Who likes candy corn? Now, I love candy corn. Any movie buffs 
know who likes candy corn or who was eating candy corn in one of the movies. If you guess Michael Myers, then you're right. Michael Myers is also an October baby. So uh, Michael Myers was born close to Halloween and he loves candy corn just like I do. So we have a lot in common. I'm curious, how many people enjoy candy corn? Candy corn is the best. I don't understand how anybody could not like candy corn. But this was one of Mike's favorites. So good. Michael also, as we all know, enjoyed eating humans and rats. Mm. This is also um, a favorite of Jason. Fingers. Mm. Human fingers. So good. Actually, this is imitation crab with cocktail sauce as the blood. But in the movies, Michael Myers and Jason both ate dogs, humans, rats. So these crab sticks represent all of those. And they're so good. Both ate humans and dogs and rats. So, so good. They also have in common, and I'll be reaching over the table. No, one's, no one else is with me. Dogs. Dogs. So they ate dogs. So I have the hot dog with the blood to represent the dogs. Now to another favorite of mine, Frankenstein. Frankenstein, he was vegan. Therefore we have blueberries, blackberries, and raspberries for Frankenstein. And we also have almonds. Even though Frankenstein, he ate acorns, I have almonds because I'm not gonna be eating any acorns. Just as, just like I'm not going to eat any humans. I'm going to eat crab legs instead of humans and dogs. But you all get the picture. So Frankenstein, he was vegan. And we have blueberries in common because I love blueberries. And almonds. I love almonds. So Frankenstein and I both have our nuts and our fruit in common. Next up, we have Freddy. Freddy Krueger, Nightmare on Elm Street. Freddy always said, you are what you eat. He believed it. You are what you eat. So he was a big fan of vegetables. So tonight I have some carrots, some celery, broccoli, some tomatoes, as well as some spinach as Freddie's favorite. With the yogurt dip. Freddie's saying he all he you are what you eat. Which is also why he ate a lot of pizza. I'm gonna be here forever. It's food, Julia. The 
service will. <laughs> Because he was a piece of shit. He ate a lot of pizza. He definitely didn't drink water. Because he was Satan himself. If you stay with me throughout the video, thank you. Please like share and subscribe to my channel comment your thoughts and your any, any ideas you may have and i will take them into consideration but please like share especially subscribe to my channel as well as click the little bell so that you can receive notifications when i post online so last but not least i have some sour patch kids and some funfetti cake. So if you all haven't guessed who, who like to eat kids? Pennywise. So Sour Patch Kids was a good way that he lured the kids. As well as funfetti cake. Pennywise loves the desserts. He is a true fucking clown and he likes coffee. So those were his goodies. The cake and the Sour Patch Kids. So as you can see, monsters, they eat good too. <laughs>